it's the merciless badass. Welcome to the murder show. What's the goddamn deal, people? Welcome to the murder show. It's April the 18th, and we got a brand new update. Patch 1.09 just went live. And they got a lot of buffing and nerfing going on out here. Whole lot of shit going on in this new patch. A lot of shit. I'm going to put the link in the description where you can go read everything for yourself. But I'm going to just run through the most important shit that pertain to us in multiplayer. Like how they nerfed the Cooter and the VMP, but they buffed the Vespa and the Razorback and everything else. We're going to get into the guns, but let's start off with the simple shit in multiplayer. They put a nerf on the slide, y'all. It say, address the exploit where players were able to gain extra momentum at the end of a slide. Bullshit. Didn't they nerf the G slide already? Now they coming back for some more. I can't do nothing but shake my head on that one. Let's see, what else is important in these multiplayer changes? Fix the issue where the black cell projectile was not properly impacting UAVs. Uh, resolve the issue where spawn logic was not being enabled in the second and fourth rounds of gameplay. I seen people taking advantage of that shit like an uplink spawn trapping motherfuckers right there in their face. They needed to fix that shit. Additional improvements to bot path selection and correction when we coming stuck. Yeah, I heard about that damn robot getting stuck, so they fixed that. Fix the issue where certain weapons could be fired faster than their intended fire rate. So if you're doing some fly shit to shoot your gun faster, they fucking with you. They did. They buffed the ante up perk too. They say they increased the start and score streak amount from 100 to 150. Whoop de do. But it's better than 100. Got a lot of changes going on to the specialist too. In general, they reduced the specialist earn rate across the board for all specialists in hardpoint. Reaper then took a buff again. They done reduced the accuracy when firing unzoomed. And they reduced the ammo count again from 120 to 100. Poor Reaper. He just can't win. First they made his footsteps loud as a motherfucker. Then they nerfed his damn uh, ammo count. Now they nerfing it again. Nerfing his accuracy. R.I.P. to him. Moving on to the Outrider. They trying to do a little better. They increased the first raise speed. Increased the ADS speed. Increase the spent recovery speed and increase the ammo count from 8 to 10. So Outrider Specialist Weapon took a buff all the way around. Spectre looked like he took a nerf. They got reduced leftover power when Spectre is killed while Ripper is active. I could have swore they nerfed that shit already, but I guess it wasn't enough. Ruin got an increased overdrive earn rate, so that's good. Nomad got an increased rejack earn rate. Even though Nomad ain't worth a damn. Reaper got increased psychosis earn rate. Vibrate got reduced heat wave earn rate. And Battery got reduced kinetic armor earn rate. Now, moving on to the real reason why you here. The buffs and nerfs to the motherfucking guns, huh? Your favorite gun, the Cooter, got a reduced one hit kill range in hardcore mode. So it ain't quite as good as it was in Hardcore, but hell, most of y'all ain't playing Hardcore. The Laser Sight Bonus. They say it's more aligned with the bonus received on other SMGs. Now that don't really say they've been nerfed. It don't say it been buffed. But the way the Cooter been outperforming all the other guns, they ought to nerf the Cooter. So that means that that's a nerf. Apparently... The laser sight did more for the Cooter than it did for the other SMGs, so now it's evened out. And also on the Cooter, it got a reduced ADS movement, but no longer lose speed while firing. So you move slower while you're aiming down sight, but you don't lose speed whenever you're shooting the way it was doing before. Same thing for the VMP, got a reduced ADS movement, so you move slower while aiming down the sights, but no longer lose speed while firing. I mean, really, that shit sound like it even out. I don't know. We're going to have to test it out. But the Weaver, shout out to that boy Nade Shot 
finally been buffed, baby, in the right way. They removed the speed reduction while firing altogether. They increased the ADS speed, increased the sprint recovery speed, and increased the five hit kill range. That weave ought to be a serious machine right about now. I can't wait to get online and check it out. The Vespa, they bringing it back. They removed the speed reduction while firing, just like all the other SMGs. But they increased the ADS speed. They increased the sprint, the sprint recovery speed. And they increased the ability to control the recall. Thank you, Jesus, because that gun show sure needed that shit. I'm telling you. The Pharaoh, they removed the speed reduction while firing and increased the ADS speed. Razorback, my favorite SMG. They removed the sprint, the speed reduction while firing, and they increased the four-hit kill range. They reduced the one-hit kill range in hardcore mode. Ain't that a bitch? Because I was punishing motherfuckers in hardcore with that Razorback. They shitting on me. It's all good. The HG-40 got a, uh, a buff, got an increase to the three-hit kill damage range. So that's lovely. Can't wait to pull that motherfucker out. Assault Rifles, the HVK-30, got an increased sprint recovery speed, got an increased aim stability, and an increased recall stability. That HVK gonna be a serious motherfucking monster. I mean, it's already a bad boy. Especially when you put a, a laser sight on it. Oh my god, I just tried this shit out the other day. But all these buffs, you looking at the best AR right there. But the ICR, the most accurate AR, also got an increased recall stability. That's beautiful. I ain't never mad at the buffs. The Shiva got an increased ADS speed, increased flinch stability, and they say rapid fire now functions properly. So, that should work out. I don't really fuck with the Shiva too much. MX Garand got an increased fire rate. Now performs better with rapid fire, they say. We gonna see if I ever get that motherfucker. Shotguns. Y'all ain't gonna like to hear this, but I love all buffs. They say the KRM got an increased one-hit kill range potential. The Haymaker got an increased three-hit kill range. And the August <laughs> got an increased one-hit kill range potential when hip-firing. It needed that shit, because that hip-fire wasn't about shit on it. Light machine guns. Now, I don't know why they doing this. The BRM. Got increased ADS out speed. I guess that mean after you putting the gun up from aiming down sight, that shit moves slower. That's crazy. They say it got an increased recall stability though. So that make it easier to aim at BRM. The Dingo, my favorite LMG, got an increased tightness of bullet spread while aiming down the sights and an increased hip fire accuracy. So the dingo was already bad, now it's even better. The gorgon got an increased ADS out speed and an increased recall stability. And increased damage through light cover. So you can wall bang motherfuckers a little bit easier yeah, on that light cover. The 48 dredge got increased fire rate and increased ADS out speed. So I got a buff to the fire rate, but that Increased ADS out speed, that sound like a nerf. I could be mistaken. I had to think about this shit. But this ADS out so definitely sound like a nerf. Somebody let me know if I got it confused. But moving on to the attachments. Oh, yeah. Told y'all a lot of changes with this shit. The laser sight. They say the laser sight got increased the accuracy bonus received from laser sight. So the laser sight basically performed better on all guns across the board. I ain't mad at that. The recon sight got increased recall stability. Now you might have not known if you throw a recall sight on, recon sight on your shit, it make your gun not bounce around as much when you shoot. Now I got a, even a, a bigger increase to that stability. And not only that, but they put that same recall stability increase on the BOA sight, the thermal sight, and the ballistic CPU. So the recon, the BOA, the thermal, and ballistic CPU all to help you aim better with this increase to recall stability. That's all good. Score streaks. 
the Rolling Thunder got a buff. They increased the drone count. Didn't say by how much, just increased it. And they increased the entry speed. So it's going to hit the map a lot quicker. Give them less time to run for cover. That's all good. The Rams deploy ship. Oh, they ain't going to like me. They increased the drone count per drop. And they increased the movement speed of the drones. They're not going to like it. They're not going to like it at all. I can't wait. <laughs> Did the Rams need a buff? Not looking at my gameplays, but I'm not going to complain. They even got changes to the maps. Nuketown took another hit. Say that and added additional spawn logic to mitigate spawn trapping. So they trying to save Lil Johnny and them from getting trapped in the motherfucking uh, tomato garden. Y'all know how we doing. Infection. Say they closed up a line of sight through the wood pile outside the barn. I don't know what's up with that. Sound like one of them little hiding spots they be sitting in. You know what I'm talking about? I don't fuck with that. Also on infection, they say they fixed the issue where players could reach outside of the intended play space. I don't be fucking with all that. Sound like one of them glitches. Oh, man. Game modes. And hardcore game modes. Say they fixed the issue where the owner of a cat package would be killed if a teammate stood under it the first 15 seconds of a round. That old trolling shit. Hardpoint. Adjusted position of objective markers inside the hardpoint zone to be more centralized. And an uplink, they improved the ability to pick up the drop satellite drone. And that ain't it. But that's pretty much it for the shit that we give a damn about in multiplayer. If you're into zombies and all that shit, you might want to go check out the link in the description and read all this shit about the zombies. Because I ain't about to get into all of that. But if you enjoyed the video, be sure to pimp slap the piss out that like button for your boy. It really do help the channel a lot. Leave me a comment. Let me know how y'all feel about all these changes. It's the murder show. Fuck with me. <laughs>